right, boys, we're back, and it's time for round three, the final four. We've had a good year, successful year. If you make it to the final four, it's always a good year. And we got the St. Louis Blues, and we're on the road once again. Now, I mean, we face St. Louis a bunch of times in every GM mode commentary, whether it be Toronto in the final. I mean, they just got a good team. And it's nice to see because in the actual NHL, I mean, I think they're still first overall. Um, so, and I think it's their goaltending, man. Halak, he's just a beast in this game. And look at this first line. See, I mean, uh, it's like, uh, okay, okay. Well, Perrin, Oshi, and Bacchus. I mean, that's nothing outstanding. 86, 85, 87. But the thing is, it looks like they have depth. You know, some other teams only had the first two lines and then nothing else. But these guys have depth. So, you got an 86, an 85, and a 87 on the first line. I mean, ours is better. Ours is better. They got some. Uh, they got a two-way and a power forward, so they might be better defensively. But still, ours is better. Their second line, Mason Raymond. Oh, no. Oh, no, he might come back to bite us in the ass. Mason Raymond, Berglund, and uh, Stewart. Um, I mean, uh, I mean the 82 is not as good, but the 88 is better than our second. I'd say our second line is still better, absolutely. Uh, Chris Stewart is, is good, but still, man, you got to give it to our uh, give it to our team. I mean, what is Landis Gog now, an 86? I think O'Reilly's an 86, and I believe Joe Hansen's an 86, so... Okay, we'll say the second line's similar. All right, we'll give the second line uh, a tie there. Third line, Samson, Steen, and D'Agostini. Again, they got some depth back there, an 82 and an 84 on the on the third line. It's better than some other teams that we've seen, so it's not bad. And then the fourth line, Sabatka, Spalling. Oh, man, they got Raymond and Spalling <laughs> and Reeves. So, I mean, they, there's not a 70 to be found. That's what I mean. They got depth. But still, I mean, we got the better, we got the better stars. We got the better offensive players, so I got to give offense to us. Defensively now... Um, no, nah, they got good defense. Yeah, they do. Jackman and Petriangelo. Um, I know Hamidic's an 88. I don't think DeHaan is that high up. So, yeah, we'll give the first line defense to them. Second line, Pollock and Shattenkirk. We'll give that to them as well. Shattenkirk's a nice 87. And then the third line, 82 and an 84. It's kind of similar to Oduya and BX, so we might have them a little bit better there. So defensively, defensively, I'll give it to them. Offensively, I'll give it to us. And then Halak, 90. And Elliott, 87. So once again, well, excuse me. Once again, we're facing a team with uh, a good starter and a good backup. All right, so defensively them, goaltending them, but offense is us. So, I mean, we got a good battle here, but I don't think it's anything that we can't handle. All right, they got depth, but still. We beat the LA Kings. We beat the, uh, the Chicago Blackhawks, man. I think we can beat these guys. Come on, here we go, boys. Markstrom's playing great. Hopefully, our uh, you guys were saying uh, O'Reilly has not had a good playoff. Well, you know what? He's due. That uh, that all, all that means is he's due. So I think he's going to have a good series here. All right, so on the road in St. Louis, game one. Come on, boys. Let's get off to a good start here. First period. Oh, <laughs> get off to a good start. Three goals against. Oh, my God. Don't worry about it, Markstrom. Don't worry about it. And it's Mason Raymond getting two goals. Are you freaking kidding me? Uh, all right, don't worry about it. Whatever, whatever. Here we go. Second period. Can we, uh, this game's not in the trash bin yet, but we need at least one goal to cut the margin down to two. Come on, second period. Oh, all right, and Spalling, penalty shot. Oh, my God. <laughs> so, oh, my God. Raven got two goals. Spalling got one goal. All my former players coming back to bite me in the ass. All right, I mean, third period. I don't see us scoring four goals in the third period. Whatever. Whatever, don't worry about it, boys. It's just one game, all right? We're facing a good team here. These guys didn't win the President's Trophy. They won the second-best second, uh, second best team in the NHL. Don't worry about it. Just put that game behind you, Markstrom. Don't worry about it. You've had a great playoff run so far. You're allowed. In my books, you're allowed to have one, you know, F-up game. So don't worry about it. Mason Raymond, three points. Good God, get out of here. Get out of here. All right, don't worry about it, boys. We're just going to game two. Not going to change a thing. Don't worry about it. We're going to come out flying in game two here. Come on, let's split the series. Split the series. First period. All right, 1-1. One, one. Oh, they got another one, but Rick Nash. Thank God for Nash. Ties it up. All right, boys. This game is still within reach. Absolutely. Second period. Come on. Come on. Get that lead. Get that lead. Oh! <laughs> See what I say? The Otter, baby. Otter gets a goal for us. Rick Nash again, Moss, and Duchesne. Another power play goal for Duchesne. All right, you see what I mean? Don't worry about that first game. Our team is going to just, oh, that was a wake-up call that first game. You pissed us off. You pissed us off. All right, Markstrom, you got this. You're not allowing four goals in the third period. No way. 
boys, I don't want to score another goal. Don't don't embarrass them. Don't let them come out on fire the next game. There you go. Just shut them down. No momentum. There you go. What a second period. What a second period. And Markstrom, after a bit of an embarrassing loss, comes back with a 27 save performance. Another game where he only allows one goal. And our offense gets five goals for us. That's what we got to do, boys. Oh my gosh. Nash. Captain Nash with a, with a two goal performance. Way to go. Way to go. And Steve Ott, two points. <laughs> I didn't get him for points, but way to go. Way to go, Water. All right. So we're 9 and 2 in the playoffs. Not gonna, man, Jesus. All right. So we split the series, both games 5-1, to one, so this should be interesting. Who's going to come out on fire here? we got our home fans. Playoff tickets are now up to 40 bucks. Oh, yeah, man. They're getting up there. All right, here we go. First period, come on out fire, boys. Come on. First period. Ooh, Stewart, Chris Stewart. All right, don't worry about that. It's only a one-goal performance. We can have a, a dirty second period again. Here we go. Second period. Come on, boys. Second period. Oh, all right, they uh, they took a 2 to nothing lead, then we tied it up. Ott gets another goal? Holy crap. Uh, Landis got, got a power play, but then they took the lead with Bacchus going 3-2. Ooh, that's a dagger goal right there. But here we go, boys. We can get one more goal. Come on. Get one more goal for Markstrom. Markstrom, oh, there it is, Kunitz. Man, our third line's been doing great in the playoffs. Come on. Ah, power play goal for Bacchus. Crap. Our penalty kill couldn't hold them off. Ah, Polak. Ah, 5-3. All right, looks like it's over. Looks like it's over. Oh, my God. Markstrom, another game where you allow five goals. What's going on here, buddy? What is going on here? I'm not liking this, Markstrom. I'm going to leave you in there. Nabokov is waiting in the in the uh, the weeds. Still, we're not going to bring Nabokov in just yet. Got to give it to Markstrom. We got to. Ugh. Man, this has been a... This has been a high-scoring affair here. Good God. Five goals. Every team that's won in the every game has scored five goals. Oof. All right, this is a, this is a must win. We don't want to go back to St. Louis down three to one. This is a must win. All right, come on, boys, come on, boys. Here we go. Here we go. First period. I need a lot of goals here. Here we go. First period. Oh, there it is. Three goals. Way to go, Manny Malhotra, Yakupov. That's a goal. Way to go, Yakupov and Duchesne. All right, all right. So our first line started clicking there. All right, here we go. It's still a game though. They can crawl back. Come on, keep that support going into the third period. Here we go. Second period. All right, no goal scored. Way to go. Way to go, Markstrom. You got this now. Markstrom's not going to allow three goals in one period. It's not going to happen. It's not going to happen. He may have done it in the losses, but you know what? He's not going to do it when we got the lead. Don't worry about it. It's a power play goal. Don't. Oh, God. Another power play goal for Oshi. He allowed two goals. He's not going to allow three. He's not going to allow three. Whoa. All right, Markstrom. I mean, you had the routine there. Thank God our team got three goals for you. That wasn't good. That was they were two power play goals, and you know what? I think, I think it was a double minor or a major because they were scored 19 seconds apart. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it, Markstrom. You're still our number one. You are still our number one. Duchesne and Nash both had two points. Way to go! So our first line's doing great. I think you guys are right. Our second line, Joe Hansen and O'Reilly, haven't done a lot in the last little bit. Come on, guys. Here we go. Uh, scouting assignment. It doesn't really matter. But I'll just send them out one more time to... Let's send them out to the QMJHL. Yeah, sure. All right. So, I mean, we're back to square one here. 2-2. Two, two. It's a best of three now. All right. We got two games on the road. But, I mean, if we win this, we can come back home and win game six. Go off to the finals, boys. So, I mean, this is a big game. It's a momentum swinging game. Who's? You know what I'm going to say? Whoever wins this game wins the series. All right? So, this is a must win. Come on, boys. Here we go. First period. Ah, come on. Polak, freaking Polak, all right, here we go, come on, second period, second period, I need a goal, I need a goal from O'Reilly, O'Reilly, you've been nowhere to be found, I need a goal from you, second period, oh, Marshawn, Marshawn, this guy's a beast, our third line, Kunitz, Marshawn, and freaking, uh, who is it, who's the other guy, Malhotra, right, yeah, Malhotra, or was it Ott, I forget who I put on the third line, but whatever, that third line is doing absolutely outstanding for us. Couldn't ask for more, but we need more from our freaking second line. Come on, boys. O'Reilly, I'm calling you out. I need one. I need one. Power play for both teams. Oh, thank God. Come on, boys. We don't want to go over. Dahan! Oh, Calvin Dahan from the points. Oh, my God. Come on. The young rookies are coming up now. Another power play. Come on. Come on. Markstrom. What a beast. What a beast. Super sweet beast. Only allows another one goal performance. 38 saves. 38 saves. We only had 24 shots. Man, Markstrom, you won us that game. Absolutely. So I know, boys, Markstrom had a, a, has had a few bad games here. Five goals here, five goals there. I know, I know. But the games that we've won, he's done absolutely outstanding. 
absolutely. Like, look at this. Two to one victory. Three to two. You can't fault him for that. Uh, five to one. All right. So in the games that we've won, he've kept he's kept them down to uh, at least two goals. So I mean, as long as our offense can score some goals here, we're looking good. We're looking good. And what did I say? Whoever won game five is going to win the series. So I don't want to go back to St. Louis, boys. Let's win it here, okay? Let us win it at home, please, please. Freaking the Stanley Cup Finals are on the line. They're calling our name. Here we go. First period. We're on a power play already. I'm going to let it go through. Come on, power play. Come on, power play goal. Please, somebody score a power play. It'd be a perfect start to the game. Damn it. What the hell? All right, here we go. First period. Oh, two goals. Steve on again. His third goal of the series. Oh, my God. Emmett Clements, the grinders. The grinders. Our third and fourth line are doing better than our second line. Berglund scored to take the lead, but Ott tied it up, and McClemmon takes the lead. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. All right, we're going to do a regular simulation. This is getting big now. Come on, boys. Power play. Oh, come on. Penalty kill. Thank God. Come on, boys. Another power play. It's a four-minuter. Oh, my God. Where's our freaking power play gone? Penalty kill. Thank God. All right, Markstrom. Come on. Please. Oh, Yakupov. That's a huge goal. Markstrom's not going to allow two goals again. It's not going to happen. Oh, Marshawn. <laughs> What is with Marshawn scoring third period, uh, like, series clinching leads? Oh, Raymond, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Markstrom's not allowing three goals to tie the game. And there you go, boys. Once again, the Columbus Blue Jackets. Man, our third and fourth line. Ott, McClement, and Marshawn all scored. Oh, my God. We have the best depth lines ever, man. Holy crap. They're doing better than our second line. Look at that. Four to two victory. I mean, Markstrom allowed two goals and 25 shots, but I don't care. He did his job. He did his job. He did not allow more than two goals, all right? As long as we can keep them less than two, you're giving our offense a chance. And nail Yakupov, two points. Moss, three points. What? Steve Ott, oh, my God, 1.4 hits. Oh, yes. What a grinder. What a grinder. And there you go. We're 12-3 and three in the playoffs, boys. Oh, we're on fire. We are on fire. It's unbelievable. So here we go. Let's simulate. Who do you think we got in the final? Is it going to be a rematch from year two, Pittsburgh Penguins? Oh, it is. It's a rematch from year two. Cindy Crosby, Gino Malkin, Chris Letang, Theo Fleury, all those good guys. Oh, my goodness gracious. All right. All right. Let's check out all the stats. Let's do a little wrap-up here of this video. We're off to the finals again, boys. Oh, year two in the finals, year four in the finals. Oh, this Columbus team is great. Uh, let us do player stats first, yeah. Let's see what kind of, uh, I know, I know we won't be able to tell too much, but whatever. I, I, I think, I don't know, man, that second line of, uh, of ours is not producing, but I don't want to change anything because everything else is, right? I'm hoping they're just due. They're going to come around eventually. I'm hoping. Uh, my God, Matt Duchesne, 20 points in 15 games. Woo! See what I mean about first line? 16 points for Nash in 15 games. Yakupov, 15 points in 15 games. So, I mean, you can't change that first line, man. They're all averaging a point a game. You cannot do that. But look at Marshawn. 10 points in 15 games on the third line. Unbelievable. Johansson. Uh, you know, hang on. Let me just do forwards. There we go. Johansson. Uh, Moss is... I think Moss is on the fourth line. He's got seven points on the fourth line. Landeskog, only six points. So, yeah, Johansson and Landeskog, they ain't doing much. McClemon, five points. Ott, five points in 15 games. He had four points in that series. Way to go. Chris Kunitz, five points. What did I say? Malhotra, three points. Oh, Riley only has one point in 15 games. Everyone on the third and fourth line. Is he? He's the worst forward on our team in the playoffs, and he's on the second line. Oh, my God. But, boys, I can't change it up because, look, our third and fourth line doing great. Our first line doing great. You just got to leave them, and hopefully, eventually, they, they get a goal here or there. Oh, Riley, though. That's not looking good. That is not looking good, but what are you going to do? Uh, plus, minus. Yeah, everyone's a plus, except for except for O'Reilly. Whatever, though. Whatever. One line not doing good, but all the other three lines doing fine. I'm fine with that. Points, Bieksa, juice, baby. Eight points in 15 games. Good Branson, eight points in 15 games. DeHaan, seven. Hamannick. So, I mean, all the defensemen are just doing their job, all right? Oduya, he's a defenseman, de defensive defenseman. I'm fine with that. Everyone's a plus player. Oh, just looking great. And I think Markstrom, yeah, it took a little bit of a hit there. He's not at 1.5 anymore, but he's still below 2, which is great. Which is great. And his save percentage is still .933. So, I mean, we've just faced a really good team in St. Louis. That's that's all. That's all. They had a couple games where they scored 5 goals, but whatever. He's taken us all the way to the finals. He's getting the start. I, I was tempted to put Nabokov in, but no way, no how. Markstrom has brought us to the dance. We're going to keep him. We're going to keep him as our as our starter, baby. Absolutely. 
So let's go team stats. Let's see what our power play and our penalty kill is doing now. Uh, goals four per game. We are still number one in the league. Very nice. And Pittsburgh is down here. All right. Goals against per game. Ooh, Pittsburgh is number one. Yeah, we've dropped down to third. So Pittsburgh might be a tough team to score goals against. All right. All right. Power play percentage. We are at 21%. That's nice. That is nice. Where's Pittsburgh? Pittsburgh is down at 10%. All right. So their power play is not doing that good. All right. And their penalty kill, it was the best in the regular season. We're 12th. And they are 5th with 90%, though. So that's very good. Oh, excuse me. So, I mean, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what to think. I mean, we swept them in year two. So, I mean, we got, we, we obviously, we've proved that we can beat them before, but. You can never say that you're just going to deal with Crosby and Malkin. They're probably better than they were in year two. Same with Fleury, same with Latang, same with Neal. So, yeah, man. I mean, Winnipeg took them, to, took them to seven games, so it's going to be interesting. It's going to be a good series. So what do you think, boys? A rematch from year two, the Columbus Blue Jackets up against the Pittsburgh Penguins. What are the odds? What do you think? Who's going to win the Stanley Cup Finals for year four? And that's coming up next.